Hi guys, I'm back here with another ending to a trade on the Cantor Exchange. Uh, you can see this big uh, green spike here, and as you know from the earlier volume spread analysis uh, videos, we were saying that there's still room uh, for the spread to for the uh, volume to continue lower, and on that particular bar we were seeing a push to the south side and so we got into a trade over here um, actually I got into one trade I had to go and take I took this trade to cover the other one and we're gonna see if this works out for us uh, because <coughs> when I saw this spike and and we had that green bar and we we're continuing lower I decided to go with the dominant trend we can see everything here the trend is down and that's why we put on these uh, little nine contracts and the one to cover the opposite direction now we've got a few seconds here and uh, we're looking to get out hopefully with something to cover this we need to be below 35 at the end of this contract still for about 20 seconds this is a tight tight trade and this is right before um, the euro session really starts with uh, Frankfurt Germany so you know it's, it's a very tight time integral time to trade I felt like my timing was a little off with entry and execution here but we're gonna see if we can eke this out one and it looks like we just eked that puppy out there again what we were using is over here looking at volume spread analysis we saw this spike unlike the earlier trade uh, that I showed this trade here because we're getting ready to start that that European session we can see a lot of a, a lot of aggressive momentum here and right here I don't have a big daddy on this I'm sorry I don't have a big foot on this chart but you could see a really nice push on the spread here this wick got me and I started uh, getting ready to go long there um, then I saw another spike and this spike right here this bar and that's what really called me to say whoa wait a minute <laughs> you know I'm going to instead I'm just going to take this bar and and I'm just going to go short I'm gonna cover my other position and just go short for these few remaining minutes because like we said earlier green on our volume spread analysis can tell us that we are essentially seeing very significant volume on that bar but there's still room for more and you can see that we did continue lower that's why I had to readjust my position from uh, where we were with the 120 35 now this is dollar yen so you know mostly what makes this effect is just all of the correlations that's there in all of the currencies in general so you know you would think well it's not a euro based pair but still there's just so much correlation in the market guys and that's really uh, why that happened I marked out this little area here you can see that on my chart marking out this little area um, to let me know that hey on, on this chart for this particular time frame this was euro uh, about to be the start of the euro session we can see over here we've got some ticks coming in uh, bears have it right now but we're starting to see a slight acceleration in ticks remember earlier when we were doing that lazy trade we saw ticks but we we were really really just not seeing any significant numbers 
that was on the euro usd this is the dollar yen um probably some more action on the euro right now but it just points out that sometimes you know you're going to in the perfect world and what you can do is to really look and familiarize yourself with these times and and with the what what you're seeing with volume these are all like little volts and we're not seeing anything in the hundreds inside of a minute so even now it's not like an accelerated volume or anything that's all I had guys see you guys on the next video we're just doing some little live volume spread analysis we do see that green remember that gives us that there's still room to grow there's that next candle which continued on in that direction all of our momentum here was indicative of that direction all of the candles here are indicative of that direction just looking at the trend we can see that trend down and it's painting itself and now's the time to be more excited because you've got more volume here you know these are some significant dark bars and you you also can be aware that this is the start of that Frankfurt uh, section of the euro session see you guys on the next video once again this is Alfred from binary options tutor dot com like share comment subscribe